Let's use a PyTest fixture to help dry up these tests. We'll start by importing PyTest. Now let's move our common test variable, or in this case, Bob, to his own separate function. Using a decorator, we can register the function as a PyTest fixture. And now we can do about injecting that fixture as an argument to our tests. And we can get rid of the previous variables we set up. Let's run the test to make sure they pass. And they do. Behind the scenes here, PyTest is going to look at the arguments included in a test function, see if they have a matching fixture registered, and if so, executes that function and passes whatever it returns down to the test as an argument. This can help to keep your tests a bit more focused and easier to read.